Hi, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we shall be talking about what are the different skill sets required to become a data analyst in 2022. So let's get started. So talking about the different skills, before talking about the skills, we'll talk about the umbrella of data science and analytics. Many people are already aware of this thing, but many people who are not aware of what exactly is data analysis, what is data science, this video will also help you understand that. So we'll start with the basics. What is the bigger umbrella? What are the different career options available? And then we'll quickly jump into the skills required. Okay. Now data science and analytics is the bigger umbrella that I always talk about. Inside the umbrella, there are multiple career paths. Data analysis is one of the career paths. Data science is one of them. BI is one of them and data engineering is one of them. Now talking about data science, well in data science, there are multiple other options. There are some options like machine learning engineer, NLP engineer, computer vision engineer, or deep learning engineer, computer vision specialist. So there are many more roles. Into data analysis, there are two different roles, major business analysts and data analysts. Talking about BI, we have Power BI developer, Tableau developer, and the list goes on. So in general, we'll be talking about data analysts in this video and what are the different skill sets required for data analysts. Now, most of my subscribers or viewers are looking forward to become a data analyst. This is what my previous polls and previous results and previous comment section has told me. So I am pretty much pretty much aware that most of my public who watches me are going to become a data analyst initially and later on they can become a data scientist for sure. Now what is a data analyst? Who is a data analyst? Now data analyst is someone who analyzes the data and to analyze data. What are the different skills required? We'll be talking about this thing in this video. So we'll start with the first and the basic skill that is required to become a data analyst. I'm not talking about programming language because programming language is not must for a data analyst. Oh my God. Wow. I can do my data analysis using Python. I can do my data analysis using some other techniques as well, using Excel or using uh, SQL databases or using Power BI Tableau. So for me, the first and foremost skill that is required for a data analyst is going to be SQL. Now, many companies are dealing with databases, not many, all of them deal with databases. Some have SQL, some have no SQL. Well, do we have to study each one of them? No. If you understand the concepts of DBMS or RDBMS or any kind of databases, then it is good enough. So if you want to learn SQL, start with MySQL or Oracle SQL. In SQL, we have MySQL, Oracle SQL, MS SQL. In NoSQL, which is basically NoSQL language, in that we have MongoDB, Prometheus, Apache, Druid, lot more options. Okay. After SQL, well, let me talk about the different skills and then I'll talk about what are the different resources to study. After SQL, the second most important skill I would emphasize will be either one of them, either Power BI or Tableau. Why? Because these are the most amount of most amount of companies uses either Power BI or Tableau. They capture almost 95% of the market right now. Power BI is somehow more than Tableau right now. Back in 2018, 2017, Tableau was a clear winner, but right now Power BI being Microsoft product, it's been accepted by many companies. At least I can talk about Asia Pacific areas. So either Power BI or Tableau. And when it comes to resources, Hold on, I'll be talking about that in the later half of the video. In case you are enjoying the stream, please like, share and subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get notified on my future videos and comment down if you have any questions in your mind. 
after power bi and tableau what is the next skill that i would learn if i start becoming a data analyst i will say the next skill will be excel microsoft excel why because many companies almost again when i'm saying these results being a statistician being a data scientist i have taken some polls and based on that i'm telling you almost 60% of the companies are using excel and excel is a very strong tool right and once you learn excel your way to learn power bi also eases up because microsoft it's a microsoft product power bi and excel right so excel is very important what do you need to learn in excel various statistical functions various dax functions how to create charts and all those things i know everybody knows the basics of excel but let's get started with the advanced part macros and vbas are not required only statistical functions all types of dax functions in excel if you know then that is more than enough so these are the important skills most important skills which is required to become a data analyst now i'll be talking about some skills which are kind of plus to you now when we talk about plus skills then the first thing i will be emphasizing will be a programming language and when it comes to programming language i always recommend python because it is literally one of the easiest languages to learn so python is also important to become a data analyst but if you don't know python or if you are not getting interest in that it's okay many companies are not requiring python experience so it's okay you can do data analysis in power bi in tableau in sql in excel as well but to ease our work we learn python because data analysis in python is very 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 easy apart from python the next plus skill i would be i would be focusing on will be business statistics what does that mean now data analysis data science everything leads to like everything is statistics and statistics in back end right so statistics leads to data science so business statistics is also required because it helps you analyze more what is the correlation now if i say can you tell me what is the correlation between this and this now if you don't know what is statistics you don't know the term correlation how can you find it so statistical knowledge is also required correlation probability theory hypothesis testing uh, central limit theorem central tendency mean median mode all these things are required to become a data analyst but it's a plus skill so these are the different skills required to become a data analyst in 2022 in case you want to get started with your career start with it immediately now i'll be talking about where to study these skills so we'll start with the basics we'll start with sql now when it comes to sql i already have two big videos almost like 4 hours of videos on sql however the quality might not be great because these are the videos where i where i launched like one and half year back but still many people can be benefited from it get started with it free course free videos go to my playlists and you can learn sql for free after sql coming on to power bi and tableau now when it comes to power bi i think my channel second name is power bi because you see a lot of power bi content on my channel yes you can easily learn power bi from my channel go to playlists there will be power bi there will be two playlists power bi and power bi projects so end to end power bi you can learn if you want to learn tableau well there is a catch i don't have tableau videos right now but if you comment down that you need tableau i can immediately work on it and launch tableau videos in within a week or within two weeks for sure so comment down if you need tableau but if you want to learn tableau probably you will have to explore some other playlists or other sources where you can learn it for free tableau project yes i do have some tableau projects in my channel i'm also uploading more and more tableau projects coming back to the next skill which is excel for excel i do have a lot of content as well apart from that in case you want to learn excel from some other play channels 
there are many other channels who are teaching excel as well i'll be not be able to name them but there are many famous channels you can just search for excel you will get it talking about python i do have end to end python playlist which is around 18 videos and around 6 7 hours of content you can easily learn python to basic level uh, basic to intermediate level business statistics also i do have various videos i think 4 to 5 videos and that is more than enough for you to get started so this is all about this particular video in case you want to become a data analyst try to capture all the skills and i wish you all the best to become a data analyst in 2022 that's it for this video in case you like it please like share and subscribe the channel don't forget to hit the bell icon to get notified on my future videos that's it for the time being see you bye bye